Since its first nuclear test in 2006, North Korea has rapidly advanced its capabilities, conducting ICBM and hydrogen bomb tests by 2017. This shift has created a nuclear monopoly on the Korean peninsula, challenging the U.S. ROK alliance. With Pyongyang's missiles now capable of reaching the U.S. mainland, South Korea faces an unprecedented threat. Diplomatic efforts for denuclearization have failed, making robust missile defense systems not just an option but a necessity for survival. In 2017, South Korea deployed the U.S.-made THAAD system in Songju to counter North Korean missiles. While THAAD can intercept missiles at high altitudes, its coverage excludes the densely populated Seoul area, leaving a critical gap. Political controversies, including China's economic retaliation and domestic resistance, further complicated its deployment. Despite these challenges, the UN administration has worked to normalize THAAD operations, but the system's limitations remain clear. To address THAAD's shortcomings, South Korea is developing its own missile defense system, the LSAM. Designed to intercept missiles at lower altitudes, LSAM complements THAAD by filling the sole coverage gap. The system, set for completion in the mid-2020s, represents a leap in domestic defense technology. However, delays and technical challenges highlight the difficulties of creating a foolproof shield against North Korea's evolving arsenal. Experts now argue that South Korea must shift from failed denuclearization efforts to a nuclear balance strategy. This approach acknowledges North Korea's nuclear status and focuses on proportional deterrence, including advanced missiles like the Hunmu and strengthened U.S. ROK alliance coordination. By matching Pyongyang's threats with credible retaliation, South Korea aims to stabilize the peninsula through mutual deterrence, rather than relying solely on defense. South Korea's missile defense evolution from THAAD to LSAM and nuclear balance reflects a pragmatic response to an entrenched threat. Yet, no system is perfect. The future hinges on cutting-edge innovations like AI-driven early warnings, space-based sensors, and deeper trilateral cooperation with the U.S. And Japan. As North Korea's arsenal grows, Seoul must continue adapting to ensure that its defense and deterrence strategies remain one step ahead.